But imagine, once you are able to sequence the genome, epigenome, microbiome, or proteome, in some sense, it becomes a big data problem. And the competitor for this thing may come from Google's of the world, not from the pharmaceutical companies anymore. In fact, I have seen the companies like IBM, which have built a complete genetic model of the heart, so that even before you go out and test the drug, you say, I'm trying to modify this protein, they can see exactly what impact it's going to have on the whole heart. So you can come up with a complete genetic models, digital models of the things and you'll be able to essentially manipulate the things and see the impact of these things and uh, once you have the big data. So once it becomes a big data problem, it is no longer trial and error. It can actually, you can be able to find both the correlation and the causation of what causes what. And I think that will fundamentally change the way healthcare is done.